I've had plenty of success in Dublin, particularly in the performance classes. Um, I've won the Connemara class three times and I've won the draft class once. Um, all on different ponies and horses. Um, it's, it's an addictive place, you know, it's a great buzz to, to get a win in Dublin and all the work then pays off when you do get the win and you feel like you've, you've achieved something. Uh, really looking forward to Dublin this year, getting back to into the RDS. Um, I have three horses qualified now. For the side saddle, I have Chesterfield King Curtis. Um, he's a 10-year-old by King's Master. Um, he only started showing last season, so it'll be his first proper Dublin. Um, really looking forward to having him in the side saddle class. He qualified in um, Charleville. He's had a really good run the last few weeks. He's, he's been a hunter champion um, in Longford and in Athlone and supreme champion in Athlone as well. He won the side saddle and the light, lightweight class in Bano. I've also qualified um, a five-year-old draft for the four five-year-old performance class. Um, he qualified last year for the final as well, so this year I'm hoping with a little bit more experience that he'll put up a good display. Um, he was working hunter champion in Langford. So I got him in the first lockdown. He was a lockdown project. I bought him as a three-year-old. Um, he is by WRS Elvis and out of a fast silver mare. I also have a seven-year-old qualified for the older draft performance class and um, he is by Gort Free Hero um, out of a Crosstown Dancer mare. So it'll be his first time in the performance class in Dublin but he was in the heavyweights as a four-year-old in the last real Dublin. 